Welcome back, YouTube. I have a few books from the Franklin Library here that I've had in uh, on my bookshelves for a little while, and I seem to have uh, forgot to do some reviews on these while I did my other Franklin Library reviews. So I have four books. I'm going to do one video per book. This is The Tragedies of Sophocles, as you can see there, and Franklin Library down here. So this is the first book I'm going to review out of the four. And uh, I want you guys to keep tuned onto my channel. I should have another 12 or maybe 15 reviews on some books that are coming in, uh, which will be really exciting. But uh, let's get down to business here. So this particular book from uh, the Franklin Library, as you can tell, it has a nice green uh, leather. High quality before the quality started going down as they uh, before they went out of business in uh, 2000. Uh, we'll show the date and the translation and such. Uh, you can see the gold embossing on the leather here and on the spine of course and the same design on the back. Like all other Franklin Library books you got the gold on the edges. Now let's get back to the volume on the inside. Uh, you got the silk more end papers, these are green. You can see actually a little bit of discoloration on the outside edges uh, from um, from time I guess. I'm not entirely sure if that's intentional but it does look like aging around. So it makes the book look older. As you can see here, The Tragedies of Sophocles. It's part of the 100 Greatest Books of All Time series from the Franklin Library. There you go, illustrated by Alan E. Kober. And here's the contents. Each book is actually translated by a different uh, translator. So Oedipus, David uh, Green. Um, Oedipus at Colonus is translated by Robert Fitzgerald. Antigone is translated by Elizabeth uh, Wyckoff. I'm, I'm trying to read upside down, so I apologize if I uh, mispronounce uh, the author's name. Ajax is by John Moore. Uh, Electra is by David Green. Uh, the Woman of uh, Trachis is translated by Michael Jameson. And... Um, I can't even read that upside down, sorry. Philoctetes is translated by David Green as well. So, uh, David Green has done one, two, three of the translations, and I see, Rob, um, I believe, who else was doubled here. I think that was uh, the only one who did, and yeah. So, the rest of the authors you see there. Now let's look on the inside here. Of course, it's printed on acid-free neutral paper like the other Franklin Library Eastern Press books. Um, so you don't have to worry about them discoloring or degrading with time. Uh, shows the characters here. And then right into Oedipus the King. I don't believe there are any illustrations, but let's go through just to, just to check. Oh, there we go. We got one illustration there. This is, um, let's see... This is an Antigone. Let's check for any more. Nope, missed one there. A nice, uh, looks like um, a Greek, uh, ancient Greek tablet that the art's on. This, that was an Ajax, as you can see in the bottom corner. Let's see if we can find the rest of them, if there are any. Yep. That's another one there, a man and a woman, a pillar in the center here. This is in Electra. And this is in Trachis here. Nice artwork. Um, should be one more here. Yeah, right at the end. And the same silk more end papers, green at the end. And of course, there's the ribbon marker. So I hope that was uh, in-depth enough for you. Like I said, it is on acid-free neutral paper. The text, of course, it's clean, crisp, and sharp. No fading or anything like that. Uh, you saw who, was trans uh, who translated the individual text. I hope that's uh, satisfactory for you guys. But if you have any uh, recommendations or advice, um, please feel free to leave them in the comment section below or in, send me a private message. If you have any other books that uh, you guys want me to do, same thing, just uh, shoot me a message.
Don't forget to rate, to comment, and to subscribe. And as always, guys, keep on reading.